Hey guys, welcome to Impex. This is the Marcy Home Gym with a 100 pound stack. And I'll tell you what, there's a lot we can do with this. So let's jump right into it and see what we can create. One of my favorite assets about the Marcy Home Gym is the fact that it has the multi pulley system. Most systems only come with one or two pulleys. It feels unstable, shaky. The fact that this has a multi pulley system ensures the fact to me that I'm going to get a great workout. Give it a shot. One of the greatest attributes to the Marcy Home Gym is the fact that it has a built in pulley system for lap pull downs. So let's get ready and get going on our lap pull downs. A good variation of the pull-up and also to work that Cobra style width of the back would be a lat pull-down. So we're gonna hit the lat pull-down and we're gonna make sure that we're gonna try to get that width of the back as far as getting the depth of the back as well. So a couple different variations. We can go with the wide grip. We have the close grip. And we also have the supinated grip, which is gonna focus more on the biceps. Right now we're gonna focus on the wide grip. Keeping our core nice and tight we're going to suck the belly button to the spine. And from here, we're going to make sure that we pull with the scapulas first before pulling down to the top of the chest. Nice and slow on the way up to get a full extension of the lats. And fire down to get a full contraction. One thing to remember is that eccentric motion, which is the portion on the way up, is the most as far as building muscle. We wanna make sure that we take our time on the way up because that's where 70% of the growth is gonna come from. I recommend three sets, eight to 12 repetitions, anywhere between 60 to 90 second rest. Give it a shot. Another great chest exercise to really shred it up is gonna be cable flex. It's great because the Marcy Home Gym comes equipped with an actual cable machine for flies. All we gotta do is get ready. We're gonna pop the pins and place it in the second hole. Up and down in the machine, keeping our core nice and tight. From here, chest is gonna be up. We're gonna get a full extension of the chest. Squeezing the pads together, nice and slow on the way back. Full extension. One of the great safety features with this machine is the fact that it doesn't let the shoulder come back past 90 degrees. That can cause a lot of problems in the shoulder laid down line. Another great movement that we can do on the home gym is a chest press. With the multi-pulley system, it makes it really easy to either do cable flies or cable chest press. A couple different variations. We can do a standard chest press. Or, we can go a little higher grip, which is gonna focus on a little bit more of the higher chest, the upper chest. Something that's a lot harder to build. It's important to make sure that you're getting a full extension and a full contraction during your chest press. Making sure that we're working those triceps, and the upper, mid, and lower chest. Give it a shot on your home gym today. Marcy Home Gym with the 100-pound stack also comes with a leg developer. Here we can hit our legs really hard and work on those quadriceps as much as possible. So we're gonna suck our spine in, keep the core nice and tight, and we're gonna do a leg extension. Pulling the toes up towards the kneecaps as hard as we can and extending the leg out. Squeezing the quadricep at the top, lowering it down nice and slow. The moldy pulley system helps keep the tension right where it needs to be on the full quadricep. 
Like any other exercise, it's important to get a full contraction and a full extension of the working muscle. I suggest you get on your home gym today and hit some quads, doing the leg extension, using the moldy system, leg belt. The Marcy Home Gym comes with three accessories. One of them is the short bar. Short bar is great because we can hit rows, and one of my favorites, bicep curls. So from here, we hook it up to our moldy cable system. Lock yourself in, core nice and tight, chest up, elbows in, curling up with a full contraction at the top. Nice and slow on the way down, keeping the core nice and tight, firing up. It's important that we're not swaying or using our back because we're focusing on biceps here, not our back and not our butt. Another great accessory for the Marcy Home Gym with the 100 pound stack is the wrist and ankle strap. This is great for glute kickback, leg curls, what have you. But I love to use it for low row. A low row is really gonna help shape that back, get the last, mid, upper, and lower back, as well as really activating the core, external and corner obliques, transverse abdominals, and rectus abdominals. Really gonna destroy that core. Plus, it really hits the glutes. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take a couple steps back, putting the tension on our arm and our back. We're going to pull our scapula together, keep the core nice and tight, and I'm in a nice athletic stance from here. All I'm going to do is pull to my hip as if I'm starting a lawnmower. One thing that's important is to make sure we're not twisting our body, we're not using momentum. We're really keeping a nice, solid tension and contraction on the working muscle. Great movement, low row, great compound movement for the back, the core, everything. I say you hook up your wrist ankle strap to the Marcy Home Gym today and hit that low row.